Carnage Blasters and Hawks will contest the Division I final of the Sulu Seniors National Table Tennis Championships out at the Racket Center in Takarigua on Wednesday night. Ruskin Mark says it promises to be a keenly contested affair, but Blasters will start as favorites. Carnage Blasters could always rely on the number one player in the country in Aaron Wilson in the Red Top, and on yet another occasion he didn't disappoint. This was just another opportunity for him to showcase his awesome talent and before too long, he notched another victory for his beloved Carnage Blasters outfit. His teammate Luko Young was taking no prisoners himself when Wasser came calling. Already up 2-0, in the third set, well, this was Wasser's last chance to get back in this one, and Parmanand had to get a move on. But every time he got a little run going, it became tough for him to sustain. That was a recurring theme throughout, as he would go on a little run only to see it halted soon enough. That's because the young always had an answer as he zeroes in on the sweep. Eventually, he would get the desired result using his cheeky sail to telling effect and closing out the deal in style for an 11-6 victory and a 3-0 sweep. Not to be left out is this young and talented lefty who gave the veteran Linda Potter Budan all she could handle. She was getting the job done with a very aggressive brand of tennis that kept Budan off balance at times. She would jump out to a big 2-0 lead on set before Budan made things interesting with a victory in the third. Queen Spark again relied on national star Brittany Joseph to get them victories and she duly obliged. She had it going on against the inexperienced Citram of Wasser and basically had her way en route to a convincing victory. But they would fall to Hawks 3-2 in the semis. Hawks will now try to lift their game as they face the highly favoured Blasters outfit in the Division 1 final. Oscar Mark, TDT Sports.